Yes. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Can we have another round of applause for Primetime and the Blackbird Review? That's the kind of impact and influence that Alan had on young musicians, and they traded. It, it was a give and take. It was a reciprocity kind of thing. You know, wise men once said, be both the painter and the painting, the musician and the music, the artist and the art. And Alan indeed knew how to do all of that. He was a gifted musician, but Alan Burns was also a veteran of the Vietnam conflict. And throughout his life, Alan recognized the healing power of music, how music had the ability to bridge gaps, to bring people together, to heal communities. And one of the projects Alan was working on leading up to his transition was the Peaceful Warriors Project, which he co-founded. Alan saw that that had, was a vehicle that could be used to heal, to bridge gaps, to build bridges. But here to tell you a little bit more about that project, because he knows it way better than I do, please welcome Michael J. Thorpe. <laughs> 